one here. Auto manufacturer makes cars and trucks at the same factory. This one's tricky because it talks about a car requiring four seats and six cup holders and a truck requires two seats and four cup holders. We kind of want to maybe say a car equation is six, um, 4S plus 6C. But you got to be careful because what we're given here is we have constraints. We have 200, 120 seats to work with, but 120 seats go into both cars and trucks. So we have we can't have any more than 120. But if I'm setting up an inequality to represent this, I have a certain number of cars and trucks that I can make. So our variables should be C and T. Question then, if that represents the number of seats, then this is our seats equation. How many seats does it require to make a car? Well, it says four seats here. So that means I should do four per car in terms of my available seats, plus two seats per truck. If I add those together, then that's, that's a constraint that I can set based on um, uh, cars and trucks and, and, and available seats. We also have cup holders. So we're looking at cup holders. How many cup holders go in a car? Well, according to this, I got six cup holders per car, plus four cup holders per truck. But I have in stock, I have 220 available. So those are the inequalities that we would set up for that particular situation. You do not have to solve that. Um, all, it just says write two inequalities that represent this constraint.